tonight we're in Hofstra. We're going to do our third town hall. The first town hall was a smaller event in our facility in Florham Park, New Jersey. Last year we did it in the Ziegfeld Theater in Manhattan. And this year, with a lot of fans out in Long Island, we thought it would be a great idea to do it uh, in the heart of Long Island. A little bit the Jets roots. So we're at a theater right in the heart of uh, Hofstra University. We're excited to be here. Good evening, everyone. Welcome to the 2015 New York Jets Town Hall here at Hofstra. You guys are going to have a lot of fun tonight, but more importantly, it's going to be a precursor of what you can look forward to this season. We're going to let it all hang out. All right, thank you for being here. It's an opportunity to interact with the head coach and the GM, both of whom uh, a lot of fans are just still getting to know, and ask them questions. What you'll find is they're great guys, but uh, they have a lot of insights that they're willing to share with the fans. This is one of the single greatest events that's not a Jet football game all season. We got one-on-one -on -one access, Q&A with the GM and the coach. I think any time you get a chance to come down out of the office and communicate with the fan base as passionate as they are, knowing how they are in the stadium, I think it's a great deal, you know, to answer their questions and just mingle with them and get to know them better. Well, I think it's a lot of fun, not just for the uh, the fans, but all the former players that still live out here. The Jets are coming back to where, for us, it all started. Uh, when I first came here in 1979, the training camps were right here at Hofstra. And to have the Jets come back out, spend an evening out here, I think it does a great deal for the community, great deal for the season ticket holders. And one of the things I think is when we do a lot of the work we do behind the scenes, uh, hopefully we can kind of sort of introduce the players to the fans a little bit, but also give them a little insight on kind of what goes in behind the scenes, how we do this a little bit, which is, you know, for all, again, for all their support and all the things they do for us, it's a, a nice way to give back a little bit. Yeah, I've seen it from a fan, from inside, from the coaches, directly to you. It wasn't a big buffer in between. It wasn't like in the stadium. This was very personable. I felt like they were talking and engaging me. As a fan, I appreciate that. I think it really is that up-close access. Um, when the season starts, uh, it's tough to get you know, that kind of uh, access to, to the coach and to the GM. And now you can really get it in a relaxed environment. And it's fun and it's informative. So it really is a terrific event. 